previously on the Bruins Recap Show. And these next two games coming up, they play Buffalo and they play Toronto. And you got to get four points out of those two games, especially when you're facing teams in the cellar of your division. That was a true statement from our last episode. And as far as the results, well, the proof is in the pudding. And I like me some pudding. And especially when it's got proof in it. As the Boston Bruins have won their last two games, beating Buffalo at Buffalo and winning a home game against the Toronto Maple Leafs. So, four big points in the last two games, and they head into Montreal for the fifth and final meeting of the season. It's game number 45 for the Boston Bruins. And can Boston make up for what was a horrendous performance at the Winter Classic in Foxborough? Also, on the season series, Montreal currently three games up, three wins, and... One loss to Boston, but Boston did beat them in their own barn, and they're looking to see if they can do it again. Let's look at some standings for a second, as Boston is currently fourth place in the Atlantic Division, with Montreal right behind them in fifth, and holding on to the final wildcard position is Montreal. The Bruins have the first wildcard position, and potentially with a win here, Boston can, depending on what else happens tonight with uh, games by the New Jersey Devils, Boston can knock out Montreal for the first time this season out of the playoff picture, which would be something to see as Montreal has been on quite a losing streak lately. We'll see if they can take advantage on this, the Bruins recap show. So we start things off in the first period as your goalies for tonight. Tuka Rask take on Mike Condon of Montreal. No David Krejci yet again in the lineup. He is not uh, available today. Practicing though, so he could look for a return on Thursday night. We'll play close attention to that. But the Bruins starting out pretty good in a very entertaining first period. As uh, a lot of turnovers for Montreal. And it leads to a goal for Boston by... The old man, Max Talbot, getting his second of the season and his second as a Boston Bruin. (laughs) You serious? So, yeah, very good first period for Boston. We go to the second period and it's getting a little shaky now as Montreal will put one in the back of the net as it's Mark uh, Barbario. I, I hope I pronounced that right. I've never heard of this guy, to be perfectly honest with all of you. Uh, and play is starting to shift to the favor of Montreal as it is a tie game. Things going Montreal's way until Patrice Bergeron, the best player on the ice, puts it in the back of the net, making it a 2-1 game yet again. And Boston will have a one Goal lead going into the third period. Don't blow it, please. Please don't blow it. So anyway, going to the third period, and the fourth line will come out, and why is this kid on the fourth line? I don't know. He's a fantastic goal scorer. He's probably one of the best young, up-and-coming talents that Boston has. It's... And he will give Mike Condon a bowl of pasta on the wraparound. It's David Pasternak making it a 3-1 game. Later on in the third period, the Montreal Canadiens will pull Mike Condon. Brad Marchand skates it out of the zone to the red line to the center ice circle and fires it point blank into the empty net with the Milan Lucic special. 4-1 4-1 final for Boston as they knock off the Montreal Canadiens in their own barn again. What a game, folks. And they will have three points up on the Canadiens with two games in hand. Oh, those are fantastic numbers if you're a Boston fan right now. Three stars of the game. Star number three. 
goes to Max Talbot with a great effort for a good goal. Star number two, Patrice Bergeron to pretty much get the game winner and your number one star. Looking amazing in tonight's game. Two U's, two K's, two points for the Tuka Rask. The Boston Bruins are on fire right now after not looking so hot. But it's been a, a, a roller coaster season. A lot of ups, a lot of downs, ups and downs and ups and downs. Grab your barf bags, grab your heart attack medicine. It's going to be that type of year. We'll see you Thursday night when the Boston Bruins take on the Vancouver Canucks and the Sedin Sisters. We'll see you then on the next Bruins Recap Show.